Hi, this is Galen with uh, Cars with Curves, and we are here at the at Highland Village for the Ferrari Festival. As you take a look around here at all the Ferraris, most of them are red and black. There's a few white ones in here, and man, these are some gorgeous cars and expensive. And we're here, and we're going to fix and start talking to some of these owners here of these Ferraris. Okay, we're here with another Ferrari, and we have Tracy here. Is that correct? Tracy Crone. And what Ferrari do you have here? This is a 458 uh, uh, Italia. Uh, it's a, a 2015 model. This is a... Oh, br brand new. Oh, brand new. Yeah, well, brand new last year, but... <laughs> that's, but that's new to me. This was a gift from my wife, so uh, wife of the year. Oh, she is wife of the year. I'd, I'd say that. Well, you must have been man of the year for you for her to buy that for you. You know, I, I don't, I don't know how she sees it that way, but uh, but I accept. Oh yeah, I imagine so. Now it looks like you get a pearlescent paint, uh, pearlescent white paint job. Yeah, it's really nice. Uh, I, normally, I wouldn't think of. Uh, uh, of, of a uh, an Italian sports car in in white, but this is an ex exceptionally pretty white and an exceptionally uh, um, fun car to drive. This is a this is uh, I, I've uh, I've raced a few of uh, Ferrari's machines before in different parts of the world, and and uh, this car is as good as uh, as the race car, but uh, just doesn't have the, the 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 roll cage and the same type of frame on it. Yeah, how many Ferraris do you own? Uh, one, two, three. Three? That's quite a few. Yeah. <laughs> now, this is gorgeous. I mean, it's like, uh, now, you have different uh, color, uh, is it like leather for the dash? It is, yeah. It's leather and dash. It's hand-stitched. They do that at, uh, at the factory in Modena. And, uh, yeah. So did you did you go over to pick it up? Uh, I did not. My, my wife... Uh, uh, work with the uh, with the factory to, to get the uh, kind of combination she wanted, and uh, and this is what uh, this was a complete surprise to me. I didn't know anything about it, so that was an excellent surprise. That was great. It was fantastic. Yeah, it was. Uh, that, that's the best way to go to get a car like this is the surprise of ever. Like you don't know nothing about it. Yeah, the surprising thing about this car, you know, they they continued to to improve the car through the through the production life. Uh, four or five eight stopped being produced now. Now they're starting to produce four eight eight. So uh, it was it was interesting to see because the race car uh, suspension on the race car is of course a little better. Uh, but but the uh, but the engine in this car is better than the race car. The uh, the brakes are better. Um, I, I mean the, the car handles better. It's just a little heavier. But uh, if it was trimmed down to race weight, it would be a fantastic automobile. This is and the transmission is better too. Oh, yeah. So do you do you like the paddle shifting? I do. Yeah. This is uh, this is an, an especially quick shift for a production car. Uh, you put it in race mode here, and this is. Uh, this is this is better. This is a much better transmission than the race car that we have. Oh, that's excellent, ma'am. So, is this the only white one you have? Or what other colors do you have? Yeah, we, we, I have I have a red one and I have one uh, blue about uh, about this color, green. Oh, green! Oh, I'm, <laughs> I don't think I've ever seen a lime green. Well, uh, it shows up well in print. It shows up uh, good in uh, in video, so that's why we uh, decided to paint them green. Oh, excellent. I think that's excellent. Thank you Thank so you much, Tracy. Yeah, Appreciate yeah, it. Pleasure. Thank you. Good luck to you. And we have Kelly here. Now, tell us about this car, what year and what type of car it is. It's a 360 Modena F1. It's one of three that we own right now. We've got a Testarossa with uh, left what, flying what, what, rear view mirror. What color is Testarossa? Red. Ooh, okay. Like, like that one right there? Exactly. Okay. And we've got a 328 as well, convertible. Okay. So, this is just my daily driver. <laughs> that's great. Beautiful. Awesome. So this is one you drive. Your husband gets drive once in a while. He drives a Testarossa. <laughs> okay, got yeah. it. Now, uh, what year is your this? What year? Ken, what year is this? 2004. 2004. Okay. Now, what's different from this one from the rest of them? Black. That's what it is. This is black. Those are both red. They're very different. The 328 is a convertible. It's a nice, nice little easy car to drive. Very small. Uh, the Testarossa is a monster, as oh, you know. Yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah, yeah. I mean, manual. All manual. You like that, huh? I do, but it's, you know, it takes uh, power to steer it, and it's a lot of fun. Ooh, that's beautiful. Oh, so you like the... Uh, so that's our next, we're gonna, that's the next one we're buying. Oh, really? And a challenge series, because we're going to start racing. 
Oh, uh, no, what What year was that one? 19... 10? What year is that? The red one. The red one. Oh, the fourth The one. white... No, the, the, the white one. one. Oh, the white one. Yeah, but we're going to get it in red. Excellent. Mm-hmm. Excellent. Now, we collect them, this, sir. It's a hobby. <laughs> Now, how many cars all total do y'all have besides Ferrari? Three right now that we drive. Okay, three. Okay. That's all we drive. We don't. <laughs> That's the other cars. Just Ferraris. That's right. Take, take a look around here, Rob. Uh, the Medina. 360 Medina. This fine looking car. Here. Right there. 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 Now, what is this back here in the back? Oh, exhaust. That's a muffler. Yeah, a muffler. Yeah. Good looking car. Car, thank you so much for taking time to talk with us. Thanks for coming out. Okay. All right, we're here with another Ferrari, and this one is white. Now, what model and year is this car? A 2008. Wow. Sorry, 2011 Ferrari, California. Ooh. Excellent. Now, who gets to drive it the most? I do. This is David here. <laughs> the Dad the, does. Yeah, Dad, Dad does right stuff. here. So, does your daughter get to drive very much? She's driven it before, but she's usually with I'd me. I'd like to drive it more. <laughs> now, what Now, what do you like better, the like paddle the shifting or the stick shifts? I like the paddle. It's easier, right? Yes, it's easier. Keep your hands <laughs> on the wheel. I hear that. Take a look around here, Rob, at this gorgeous car. And it looks like the interior. It's a chocolate interior. Chocolate. Now we're fixing to see, which I've never seen, well, a top go up or down with a Ferrari. Oh, look at the Ferrari emblem in the seats right here. Embroidered. Wait, wait, that's right, right. Oh, it's got a glass top also. Oh, I like that. Oh, no, it doesn't have a glass, a glass back. Oh, that's fine looking. Now, now, that is a short amount of time that that top came up. Yes. Man. It, it comes up faster than it goes down. It's about 15 seconds. Oh, that's quick. Down, 10 seconds coming up. There you go. Now, one thing's missing. Where's personalized tags? I just haven't done it yet. I had a Maserati. I had a personalized plate on it. It said Maz 185. Oh, you can't do that on the Ferrari. <laughs> Well, thank you, David. Appreciate thank it. You, thank David. you so much. Pleasure Appreciate it. Appreciate okay, it. here we are. Interview with a, another individual who has another Ferrari. And what Ferrari is this? Oh, we have Julio here. Yeah, the California. Oh, really? Yeah, yeah. The new, it's not the T1. It's the normal California in the, this blue color. Now, is there a special color for this? I mean, a special name for this color? Uh, it's you know? the, the blue, I think it's blue course or something like that. Blue course, okay. Uh, blue something. So this is a convertible hardtop. Yeah, it's a convertible hardtop. Uh, it's 2015. It's uh, around 496 horsepower or something. Ooh, that's a lot of horsepower. Yeah, almost 500 horsepower. <laughs> yeah, a lot of. Now, take, take a look around here, Rob, the car. Uh, now, we were just watching another uh, Ferrari. Uh, Italia, uh -huh. the what they did the top for us, it came up and all, uh -huh. so it comes up real fast. Yeah, it's I think 14 seconds. Or so. Oh, that's fast. Yeah, yeah that's real pretty, fast. Uh, yeah, you can do it in a light, like in a red light, you can change it. Oh, that's quick. Yeah, that's true. quick. <laughs> now, uh, do you like the paddle shifting? I like the paddle shifting. Yet, I'm not so good. So but I, you like stick shift better? Uh, no, I th I like it, the paddles. I th I think they're better. But I'm not so good, so I prefer the automatic. <laughs> well, yeah, like, uh, do you get to drive the car very much? Is this your dad's car, right? It's my dad's car, yeah. You it's thank you, Julio. Thank Appreciate you. it. Thank you very much. Thank you. Here we are with another Ferrari, of course, since it's Ferrari Festival time yes, in November, and it's not raining this year. Thank God. It rained last year, just like uh, November the what, 12th today, 13th? Uh, I don't even know. <laughs> Somewhere around there. And uh, who are we talking to here? Uh, Dark Cavasport. All right, I'm Galen. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. And tell us a little bit about your Ferrari here. Uh, it's a 2014 458 Spider, uh, and I bought it about a year and a half ago. This is my fourth Ferrari, so I upgraded, and I love this car. This is uh, very different than anything else that I've had. Oh, really? Yeah. Now, uh, 
Now, so you got rid of each Ferrari every time you bought one? Correct. Okay. Do you have any other cars? Yeah, I have a uh, Corvette and a Jeep. Oh, there we go. <laughs> All around. <laughs> now, this is not a daily driver. This is just a nice day driver. Oh, yeah, yeah. So. Oh, yeah. So, now, are you ever going to uh, up your collection of cars ever? Well, of course, that's any little kid's dream. This was my dream when I was five years old. And uh, if, if it was uh, possible, I'd have every Ferrari. But unfortunately, <laughs> I don't have a budget for that. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thanks for your time. Appreciate okay. it. Now we're here interviewing another individual. And this is a Ferrari festival. And all of a sudden, we've got a, a Lamborghini in here. This is Chris. <laughs> That's right. Bulls are up. Bulls are up. How, how, how'd they let you in here? <laughs> they, get, they let a few of us in. That's about it. You know, they keep it. It's all horses and a couple bulls. Now, t tell us about this. Here, come over this way. But tell us about this uh, individual car that you have. What? This model? is uh, 2007 Lamborghini Gallardo. Um, I actually just traded a Ferrari for this. Oh, so, did you? Yeah. Um, I wanted so to that was the password, Ferrari. I had one. I, I, I wanted to go to the dark side. <laughs> uh, so, uh, no, it's, uh, God, I'm about to hit 30,000 miles on the car, 530 horsepower. Um, could be an everyday driver. It's, oh, it's, it's, excellent. Man. It's like so what Ferrari did you have? That I actually had a 355 Spider, um, <laughs> and uh, I loved it. Sounded great, but uh, I just knew it was time to move on. <laughs> <laughs> now, uh, did you go from stick shift to paddle shifting? Uh, a car at, ho at home, I have a manual. All my cars have been manual. Uh, this one and the Ferrari were both paddles. Uh, my Ferrari was the first year the paddles came out. So it was it was a little bit getting used to, but it was uh, definitely nice. <laughs> I enjoy the show, Chris. Thank, Thank you so much. much. Okay, now we've moved across the street from a the Ferraris over there now are crossed over here and we f have found a La Ferrari. This car is like one and a half million dollars for this car, 950 horsepower and this is a 2016 La Ferrari. As you see we got a couple of models over here standing beside the car and uh, I don't think they're going to be driving the car anytime soon but this is one sweet gorgeous car. You know, as you take a look at this car and take a look right here in the scoops right here the fans they have the fans so they can cool cool the engine off and the, you know the engines in the the rear of the car so they got radiators all over the place for this car take a look back here we got uh these are uh gold wing doors that you get in and out of as you notice right here and back here in the back is your huge engine with a, the, like I said the 950 horsepower and this is one gorgeous car I mean uh, it's like whoo wee I wish I could have this car it'd be gorgeous it's gorgeous panning around here before the crowds got really big and all we're trying to show you what Ferraris are here you know, a lot of racing Ferraris, a lot of yellow ones, red ones, but mostly a lot of red Ferraris and and a few white ones sprinkled in here and there and black ones and all. It's like gorgeous, always gorgeous cars, you know. And it's like we're here for our viewers for you to watch this that you missed, that you did not get to show up at. <laughs> Okay, here we are with another Ferrari, and this is a the 2014 Especial 458. And as you look here, you got the gray stripes, a coarse red Ferrari, and look at the license plate up there, Ferrari. <laughs> I love those license plates, man. And come around, and take a look at this car right here, gorgeous car. And look inside here, we got little. Um, bears in here ferrari bears is that what that is ferrari bears yes take a look at this now the engine back here now the engine is gorgeous i mean impeccable i mean no dust no dust on it or anything like that right there i mean it's gorgeous car another 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 red ferrari <laughs> okay now we're here with another individual with another red ferrari There's a lot of red ferraris out here and this is jeff here Jeff, tell us a little bit about your car. It's a 94 Ferrari 348 Spider. Got about 12,000 miles on it. Oh, that's low mileage. Wow, wow, wow. I drive it every week. 
Oh, do you? I do. Uh huh. Oh, you got to to get the cobwebs out. You got it. Let's get the cobwebs <laughs> come, out. Come take a look. The car here, and uh, now the, the rakes down the side. I love the rakes down the side of the car. Uh huh. Now that's for air intake. Okay. Mm -hmm. Now, what uh, uh, the engine on it is it a, uh, aspirated regularly or is it turboed or what? No, it's just it's not it's not turboed. It's a regular. Okay. And uh, so take, come here, take a look at the inside of the car right here. Since it is this unusual, the spiders are usually. Uh, I'm sorry. The spiders are usually convertible, right? Yes. Uh huh. Yeah, that's the old-fashioned. Stick shift. Hand crank down, stick shift. Yep. Oh, I love that. Yep, yep. I, I have a Shelby and this ah, stick shift. Oh, <laughs> they're fun. Yeah, that's what makes them so much fun. Oh, yes, of course. Yep, exactly. <laughs> thank you so much, oh, Jeff. A gorgeous you. car. Pleasure to meet you. Okay, here we are with another Ferrari. We have another Ferrari owner, and your name is? Bob Wiener. And uh, tell us about your Ferrari that you have here, this gorgeous Ferrari. Okay. This is a uh, 1961 Ferrari 250 GTE. This was Ferrari's first major uh, production 2 plus 2 model. Uh, from 1960 to 1963, they made 955 of these. Uh, well, 2 plus 2 is like for a back seat. Correct, correct yes. And But mechanically, it's got the Colombo. 3 liter V12, which is the same basic engine that were in Ferraris that won at Le Mans, yes. and in the 250 GTOs, which are the 40 to 50 million dollar cars. That's a lot of money for cars. It's a lot of money, <laughs> and this car was very popular in period because it had the mechanical sophistication of a race car with the luxury of a GT and you know so you could got it's got a big trunk you could take your wife and yeah. drive down if you lived in Europe you could go down to Monte Carlo for the weekend right. plenty of room in the trunk for now, her to buy it, stuff uh, have, have you had the car very long I bought it 45 years ago Woo! oh my god I bought it right out of college um, and uh, you know, had an opportunity and had gotten some money from a training program, and always wanted one. And wow! And okay, now is this your only Ferrari? Yes, it's my only Ferrari. It's not my only old car, but it's my okay. Only car. You have more cars? I have. I have. Yeah, I have a '52 Allard. And, wow. and a 1925 Amel car. I don't know what that is. It's a little French Vacheret. And then I've got a 58 Morris Minor Woody. Minor Woody. Woody. I don't know what a minor is. Uh, it's a little British uh, car. Um, and You, like, you like a lot of foreign cars. And, yeah, and I like eclectic, so you can right, tell right. them. So it's a very oh, yeah. different collection. That is different, I collect it. Yeah. Well, thank you so much for showing okay. me your car. All right, take, let's take a look at the in interior of your car. Now, is the interior... Excuse me. Can we go back? Take a look inside here. Yeah, yeah. Take a look at this gorgeous car inside here. It's got the stick shift and not paddle shift like the new cars. <laughs> Now, take a look back here. Yeah, chrome wheels. See the wheels? All chrome. Well, look at this gorgeous car. You know what? I think we need to end the show right here. It's a gorgeous day out here for the Ferrari Festival. And we're so glad that we get to film this to show you all these gorgeous cars. Ferraris. We're out of here. Ciao.